Hello friends, welcome to Healthcare Management Strategy app built in Flutter and Firebase. This is an open source community project with complete source code without any subscription cost. And this is going to be a very special video today. My name is Amit Shukla and I was hoping that through, app, through this app, I can contribute to society and bring some joys to my co-healthcare workers. Unfortunately, as you know, we all are living in a very difficult pandemic times and which require all of us to take extra precautions and make quite a few adjustments to our daily lives. Fully vac vaccination, um, wearing productions like face masks, gloves, practicing use of hand sanitizer, and maintaining at least six feet physical distances are new norms. We are also very often asked to avoid unnecessary travel. And I work remote so as much as possible. And being a healthcare worker myself, I know how inconvenient it is for my patients. So the solution is we developed an app. This app is built in Flutter, Firebase, React, and Loom SDK. Let me tell you about the Loom. I came to know about the Loom that this is a messaging protocol, like this is a uh, ready-made available SDK, which helps you create little bit of like, you know, short messages, uh, and you can, you know, include those message SDK within your application. So that's exactly what I'm going to show today. And the idea is this app, let me tell you something more about this app. Let me log in. So here I'm going to log in as my, um, as my as an admin account as as uh, sorry as an being healthcare worker okay and settings okay so the idea is as you can see as an admin login do you have a lot of things going on in healthcare people think that you're only seeing a patient but that's just being a part of it you have to set up the appointment, vaccination, OPD, IPD, pharmacy, lab results. So it becomes a supply chain. Supply chain is an integral part of your overall healthcare organization um, applications, right? So in this um, in this area, what we figure it out, how we can avoid patients um, in person, unnecessary in person visits to the healthcare organizations, and that's the idea of about this app. So that's what we try to implement this in Loom. So here, what happened, like you know, um, if for unnecessary in person, so before coming to the showing up to the doctor office what a patient want to do or maybe it can be the same things can be applied to other areas like supply chain or maybe you know um, healthcare to healthcare um, communications or like any pharmacy to healthcare lab to healthcare anywhere else where a message a video message or you know a in-person um, uh, in-person communication is required so this loom sdk can be a very powerful tool so in this area what we did here as you can see this is the uh, patient's panel uh, sorry, admins panel. So here your healthcare provider is able to see and receive the messages from the patients and is able, able to, you know, record the messages and reply to that messages to the patients. Now this database is fully secure. And uh, let me show you quite, now let me show you the database side of it. Okay, all right, as you can see, the, this database is built in Firebase. In Firebase, this is the person and this is the person who just logged in. And inside the person, there's a messages um, you know, a collection, a document, and there I am storing all the URL, the Loom URL. So this uh, database is highly secure. That means the person is only um, authorized to see only their documents and no one else other than the healthcare provider. Or if the person gives us, uh, you know, and you know, a person gives an explicit consent to view their health record, only that person will be authorized to see that. So the whole idea is that we implemented this messaging um, messaging system, messaging communication inside this application. So here, as you can see, and it's not only confined to patient to healthcare provider, the idea can be implemented from healthcare provider to um, to patient, pharmacy to lab technician, lab to, so that you know, the whole idea is patient see all the communication related communication in his um, using his ID only. Let me log out and log in as a patient again so that you can see it better. So here, for example, I'm going to log in as a patient here. It works. Right. So as you can see on the left-hand side, the patient, this is the patient's uh, portal. So here the navigation changes and the patient is able to communicate through text messages as, as well as the video messages. So in follow-up videos, I will show you the extreme, you know, all the codes, all the code walkthrough. I will do the detailed code walkthrough so that you can understand how the coding has happened here. And it's extremely easy SDK to implement. And uh, meanwhile, you will be able to find entire source code for free in this um, in this repository. This is an open source community project. I hope you like it. And in case if you have any comment, if you have some other ideas, how to implement this Loom SDK in some other portal, please feel free to let us know. Well, uh, that's all I have to share for now. Thank you very much.